Brutally Honest Livestock. Thanks for the comment. This comment was left on the video that we posted a few weeks back that became uh, pretty popular on TikTok. The video was about how we handle lazy and heavy-headed steers, which is, if you remember, we tie their heads up to a uh, bungee cord in the stall. The bungee cord keeps pressure on their head, keeps them lifting it up, and it keeps them from just resting their head on a panel or just from hanging from the rope. Now this is uh, the actual bungees that we use. You can get them at Tractor Supply, Lowe's, and other retailers as well. I am a little perplexed and trying to figure out how tying your calf's head up results in a dead calf. It's a pretty standard practice that just about every show barn and exhibitor that I know of uses on a daily basis. Now, I didn't take the time to call the manufacturer or the retailer that sells them to find the braking strength on the strap. But I did go to the Googles, and uh, according to the interwebs, they state that a 7 millimeter rubber tarp strap typically has a braking strength of about 50 pounds. Now, do the math on your calf. What it should equate to is something that most exhibitors and show barns already know and that's the fact that these are large animals if they don't want to be here doesn't matter what you do son you can't keep them here so let's say the braking strength is 100 pounds which is twice what the internet says so if your calf feels like it's in danger or about to pass out or just simply doesn't want to be there anymore it's not going to take very much effort to get free on his own power. Now I guess you could make a argument that a calf could expire while having their head tied high. Uh, I don't think a bungee cord is necessarily the reason why that that would happen. Um, but I had just simply haven't watched enough Final Destination movies to come up with a reason as to why that would play out. 